Hi everyone, this video I want to show you a bit more information about enabling Dolby Atmos uh, when playing Cyberpunk 2077. Well, I searched a bit and, uh, well, this is actually a paid uh, uh, feature and uh, it's not actually a paid feature on every uh, platform because it depends. For example, if you use it on the Xbox Series X or Xbox Series S, it's, um, no, this is actually the first console with, that comes with uh, Dolby Atmos enabled. Uh, but uh, for Mother Raid, you need to actually download the Dolby Access app. Now this is from SlashGear.com, as you can see, Xbox Series X and S doesn't require a separate purchase from Dolby itself, user would just still need to download the Dolby Access app to get it to work uh, on those. So again, if you are gaming on the Xbox Series X or S, you have Dolby Vision Atmos already uh, available in your consoles. But again, for Mother Raid, you need to download the Dolby Access app um, to the console. Now you might have a gaming laptop that actually comes with a Dolby Atmos uh, built in. And you actually don't need to pay for it, from my understanding. You see here, this is for the Lenovo Legion laptops. Now, I check it out myself for my Lenovo laptop, which is Y540, uh, and of course I have it built in. There's no actually option to purchase anything, so it's kind of free. Uh, you can see here, this is in the Lenovo Vantage uh, settings. Because I already enabled it, you see Dolby Audio is enabled. Because I chose in the Lenovo Access Dynamic, it also appears here uh, in the setting of the Lenovo um, Vantage. And again, there's no option for you to actually buy anything. Uh, it doesn't seem to be a trial, so check it out on your laptop and see if you have it as well. Now you can see this is the Dolby Access page on the Windows Store, and you can see it's free, but there's a plus sign. Why? Because it's offered in a purchases. So I believe that once you are downloaded, you only get an option to activate a trial. Because at the same page, it says, you see, uh, uh, in Dolby Atmos today, by stacking your free trial. So basically, you're not going to have a, a free trial. You're going to try it out if you like it. Uh, you need to pay for it and probably the app will offer an option to do that. Now I went to search for more information regarding pricing and this is from PC Magazine. The article is from June 18, 2020. As you can see, the Dolby Atmos for one feature however require a $15 in a purchase. Or you can try it out for 7 days to see if you like and then you can actually choose if you want to buy it. Now I personally didn't see any trial option, uh, so I just assumed that I actually get it uh, for free, the headphone options. Uh, again, because there isn't a buy option on the official website, nothing that I found, I can't really tell. So maybe you can expand on this one if you um, uh, download it and you don't have it built in in your computer, whether the trial option actually appears in the Dolby Access feature, or, or the, sorry, the Dolby Access uh, software. So that's the extra information I found with Adobe Atmos uh, if you plan to use it uh, when playing Cyberpunk 2077. Again, if you have anything to add, let me know in the comments section below. Thanks for watching, consider subscribing to my channel and give this one a like. i see you on the next video. Cheers everyone. Bye bye.